Hey guys, I'm back. And I'm on a bike, and as you can probably hear, there's no ticking, strange ticking sound. Because I swapped back in the original 125, so it's basically just a stock SSR 125 now. Um, this is my, well, I sold this motor to my friend, but no, neither of our bikes were really running, so he let me just swap back in so I can actually ride, and he has a you know different bike now, but. Yeah, so basically, uh, I was gonna film the swapping it and everything, but I decided just to do it, and it took like a half hour. I got you know the 140 out, this one in, and uh, what we're gonna do is actually just tear apart the 140 like completely, and I want to figure out what that taking sound is and why, it's, you know, smoking bunch. I think it's burning oil or doing something. But I'm just gonna take the whole motor apart. I'll make videos on that. And I'm just gonna inspect everything, and maybe need a gasket or maybe need something. So I'm gonna figure that out. But until then, I have this bike, and man, it's just so bumpy out here. This stiff pit bike, tiny suspension. Anyways, yeah. But uh, also, my friend got that 125 comes with the 14 tooth front sprocket stock. Um, my friend bought a 16 tooth sprocket, and he never put it on, but I just put that on. Um, so it feels a lot. It, it's longer gearing. It make, that's what it does. It makes a longer gearing, a larger front sprocket. So I can go higher top speed, just not as much accelerate. Oh, that's fourth gear. It's not as much acceleration, I guess. It does fourth gear, and I'm cruising like this at lower RPM. It does feel quite a bit faster, which is nice. It won't be. It's not as hoppy anymore either. In like second gear. Um, yeah, it's running better. I actually I cleaned out his carb and put it back on because it didn't have my carb from the 140. But yeah, I just cleaned out this carb and put it on and. Uh, Stuff like that. That was a DNR. That was DNR. That was DNR. I did not even realize that was DNR. Are they not turning around? <laughs> I'm just gonna cruise up onto these trails really quick. Just in case they turn around. That's funny. Anyways. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, it feels a lot, a little bit faster, though. Uh, yeah. What we're just gonna head on to these pipeline is that, I don't know if that's him or not. Yeah, we're gonna cruise out onto the pipeline. Ugh. Yeah, so, uh, head out here and just kind of check it out. I haven't been riding in a while. This is the first time I've ridden in quite a while, you know. Just getting used to it again. Riding our bikes. But, uh, you know, good stuff. Out this water area. Oh crap. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh, should I go? Huh. Alright. Uh, I'll probably go this way. Or that. We're gonna try going that way. We're gonna go mudding it with my completely bald tire. Come on. There we go. Oh, that mud I hear. Oh, I feel the mud hitting my uh, neck. Uh, all right, we're good. Head over onto this. Area. Oh, there's tracks right there. Oh, and they mowed this. All right. How does that? I feel the mud in the front of my shirt. It's like it went around. I don't know. I hate having muddy rear tires and dying. Why does it feel so bumpy? Oh my God! There's why? How? There's mud all over me. I feel it inside of my shirt.
Yo. Anyways. Head over here. electrical plant. Some lights on. I don't think there's people here, but we'll turn around if I see any vehicular devices. I'm just going to cut through here though. good. Man, this tire is so bad. I just feel it sliding out every time I turn and give it a little bit of gas. I just feel it kind of sliding out. Over here, just a little bit. Yeah, I feel it bogging down a lot more with the smaller front sprocket. I was like, I don't even know what that was. Oh my god, it's made money. <laughs> Alright, let's see any like rocks. Nope. Oh, oh my god. I hate doing that. I always get soaked. It's worth it though. 
Man, if I get a nice tire on this thing, this thing will rip, but bald tires for the win. <laughs> Trying to pop a wheelie and get some air. Man, it's growing in a lot back here. Man. I'll be tearing this up soon though. Now that I actually have a running bike, hopefully, kind of. I mean, it, it runs fine right now at least. Look at this. Look how grown in this is, this is insane. Oh man, can I make it up this? No, oh, come on. Oh, well if I hop my chain off, I can't. Don't be popped up. Yes, not popped up the front one. Okay, so I can just put it. Okay, should slip right back on. Chains on these bikes. They just like loosen up after five minutes of riding. There we go. Uh, I'm glad that was simple enough. I think with the bigger sprocket on the front, it can't even pop off into the front anymore like it used to. It's got a bigger sprocket, and there's not very much room for it to even go. So that's good. Cause that's a bitch getting the front sprocket up. Come on. Yup. Oh, no. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Oh. too tight. These tires are just slipping. Any logs, no logs, we're good. Oh man, it's sketchy. All these, there's like logs all over the ground, but you can't see them until you're like right there, and then I'll probably die. <sighs> Anyways. Oh. We got this. You know, I'm sticking her in neutral. This is. Deep sand, thick, deep, deep, thick. The idle's a bit high, I gotta bring that down. Those deer tracks. Oh god, come on. Come on, little 12, 14 inch, whatever it is. Wheel, you got this. Alright, man, it is hot. I'm gonna go back and get a Mountain Dew, I think. Ooh, that sounds good. Yep. Anyways, I guess didn't really have any plans for this, just kind of riding around. Exploring, finding some changes out with some stuff, seeing some DNR officers. But, uh, yeah, I guess I'll head back. It's summer, so no school. That means I can ride a lot more. Um, I got a job, so, you know, not ride a lot, lot more, but I guess more than I 
did before since I actually have a running bike now. So that'll be good. Bike videos for you guys, listen to car videos for you guys since I have a job. We'll be buying some stuff for the G. Hopefully if everything goes right. Ugh. Yeah. I, oh, why'd I go that? I need to go slower through that, but I don't want to go too slow because I don't want to fucking die. Oh god. Now my wheels are all slippery. I don't like it. I do not like going through that. I need to build a bridge over that. Even though it's, I think it's illegal, but just like doing something to state land. I don't know. Anyways. Oh, fuck, I'm soaked. I'm going to head back. Well, I already am heading back, but you know, we'll YOLO. Can bank on these, get some banks, race around these on a wall. Anyways, do a little speed run. Is there no cars? Nope, we're good. I'll do a little speed run. I'm not gonna fully max it out. I'm gonna change the oil. I'm not sure how long this oil has been changed on this thing, so I don't know. Probably like blow up, but whatever. A little bit of an uphill. Doesn't have to feel that fast. Huh. Whatever, I'll measure sometime. But uh, yeah. Anyways, I guess that's basically it. I'm gonna actually head to Ron. Yeah, I'm gonna head over here and then turn around. But you know, it's basically it. So thanks for watching. Hopefully it's recording and uh, mic's working. But if not, then YOLO. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna dry my pants off. What if I can do an endo? I don't want to. <laughs> Anyways. Oh wow. Private. Oh my god. That's kind of weird. Private property and trespassing. Those weren't there before. It was like a. It's kind of weird because, you know, actually, like. What was it? Like a few days ago. Um, it was actually pretty funny. I was about to do donuts right here. I was like going where that car was. I was pretty much just like that car and I was slowing down. I was going to whip a donut right here just because I felt like it. And uh, there was a cop right there. Like right there. I, I barely saw him, I like started slowing down and something like, oh shit, so I sped up again, but anyways, they were just kind of sitting there, and I don't know if they were in the house or doing something, but I thought people still lived there, so I wonder if it, something happened, it got like, I don't know, it's called repoed or something like that, repossessed by like the bank, I don't know if cops have to go there for that, but it's kind of weird though, a <laughs> cop's in there for a while, and then now it's like, no trespassers, there's nobody there, everything looks like he's gone, I don't know, it's kind of weird though, <laughs> anyways, all right. That's kind of weird. Huh, all right. Anyways, it's kind of cool, but not cool, I guess. kind of weird. I didn't know them anyways. I think they hated us, so. Anyways, it is hot. Thanks for watching. Let her cruise for a little bit and cool off. But uh, thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. Yeah, probably be another motor vlog, but maybe a car thing. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. But thanks for watching. Just gonna continue this on. Keep talking until I get back all the way. You know what I'm saying? All right. Well, see you later.